another episode with Cooking with a Chef here at Octagon Restaurant. Um, we have Executive Chef Paul Krawick and I'm Furu Krajab, your host for the day. And Chef, first of all, I know it looks like a science project here going on, but before, before we start this fun episode, what I call, I wanted to congratulate you on your win for the Taste of Mystic. Uh, well, thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, we had an excellent response. Um, we won People's Choice yeah. as well as the most creative. So. Well deserved. Well deserved. Thank you to everyone who voted for us. Yes, absolutely. So uh, I know it's a new toy you have in the kitchen. Yes, it is. <laughs> it's very exciting, and we're going to play with it today. So what is that? Yeah. So today we're having fun with science. Okay. And this is we're dabbing a little bit into uh, molecular gastronomy by using liquid nitrogen, which is at a, a negative minus 321 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's a very cold liquid that when you bring it into the atmospheric pressure, it boils. It turns into a gas. Oh. But it allows us to freeze things instantly. Amazing. But so it's also very dangerous. So I mean, <laughs> when you say things, you, your finger can freeze instantly. We don't want to. Okay, I'll keep my that fingers out of that episode. <laughs> but uh, so hopefully we're gonna. Uh, what are we gonna make with it today? We're gonna make a uh, a cider gelato. Cider gelato. Because yes. it is fall, and what better time to make a cider gelato? I'm all for it. And I know we we did the other gelato with the machine last time. It took yeah. 20 minutes. This is instant instant cider Steam. gelato. Oh, it's a lot more fun. Great. Well, I'm very excited. So we're gonna start by transferring some of the the liquid nitrogen out of the tank into into our vessels. Okay. And we want to do this more at a at a ground level because again, you don't want yeah let's this not. going into your eye. I hear you. It would not be. No. Nope. So like I was saying, it's about as dangerous as as your fry oil is. Yeah. Except to see off your fry oil is 350 degrees. Hot. This Fahrenheit. Is this is this is the opposite. The opposite it right? will give you a burn just as quick and be just as dangerous if it went into your eye or if you stuck your hand in it. So you'll see that it's yeah. boiling. You yeah. Just, you just, yeah. And that, that's what it is. It's it's boiling because at this atmosphere. Uh, uh, pressure, it boils and turns into a gas. So it actually does dissipate ra rather quickly if it's not in a sealed container. So first we're going to have a little fun okay. with science before we actually make the gelato. So we're going to see how it, how it works first. We're going to take raspberries. We just toss it in there really quickly. Like I said, it's, so it brings it down to... Yeah. Wow. And you can actually just tap it. And this is really neat. Now, you wouldn't want to stick this in your mouth right now. Okay. But as it has many different applications in, in, in the culinary world. Like, I mean, it breaks out each little each little vessel. Yeah. And then this will defrost, and it's a beautiful garnish for, for, your, uh, for dessert. The moisture in the fruit is what sticks to your tongue. Yeah. If you take, this is a, a freeze-dried apple. So we're putting a freeze-dried apple in here, and again, there's no moisture in there, but we are bringing it down to a very low temperature. And it's just a few seconds. And you can actually handle this, because again, there's no moisture. Yeah. And then watch. No watch, and you're going to eat it. We eat it. Oh! You get the... It's like the dragon fruit. <laughs> right. Again, if you have sensitive teeth, it will affect you. <laughs> well, fortunately, I only have one. But you get that instant, um, like, rush of very cold, and then yeah. the, the flavors from it. Yeah. This is a, this is a great episode, Chef. I'm it's fun, like I said, fun I'm, science. I'm glad you invited me. Yeah, so now I'll do yeah, I'll chew on it and breathe through your nose and... Yes, yes. <laughs> Very interesting. Isn't this fun? It's a lot of fun. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. So, now we're going to make some gelato with this. Excellent. This is a very simple gelato, very simple recipe. Right. And again, because it's, it is fall, yeah. we're going to... Um, we make a nice fall flavor. We have uh, some heavy cream, a little sugar, uh, a fresh apple cider from a local farm. I like to put a dash of cardamom. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You have cardamom? One of my favorite spices, actually. I love cardamom. Cardamom is a wonderful spice. It's actually one of, uh, it's, it's the third most expensive spice in the world. Is it? So I scraped a little bit of the, um, this is actually a Madagascar uh, vanilla bean. The yeah. cardamom, I add a little bit of cinnamon, it's the sugar, the apple cider, and the uh, heavy cream. And I'm just going to mix that up a little bit, get all the flavors together, and this is where the science comes in. Yeah? So we have... 
All right. Back oh, to my liquid nitrogen. Now, what you're going to do, you're going to add it slowly. I'll tell you when to stop, when to go. All right. And I'm just going to mix it up, so slowly. So what would happen if we put too much is that I'm going to have basically ice cubes in here. Right. So we have our, how long was that? 60 seconds yeah. or so. You know, uh, again, the, from the culinary side, it, it, uh, it produces a very, very smooth um, ice cream or gelato. You know what, it also, it's not just that. It's we're producing quality product yes. for our guests. It's amazing how, you know, the, 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 imp the flavors, when, when I put that piece of apple in my mouth was... Right, they just burst. I mean, if you compare it to... Just, the apple itself, freeze dried tastes very good, but yeah. you get, just get that rush of, of, right. of flavor. And look at the effects that it has on the actual product coming out yeah. from the kitchen. Right? Fun. It's amazing. It looks so good. Now... Now let's try it. Let's try it. That's right. Chef, another success. Thank you. Cheers. Salute. So, did you have fun? I had a great time, did Chef. Did you learn anything? I learned a lot. Yeah? I did. I learned a lot. Well, I learned a lot about my spices. Well, reminded me. You reminded me again of my spices. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. So we had fun with science. Yeah. Um, and we made a, a wonderful product. Again, you know, Octagon Restaurant, Mystic Marriott come down. We were really playing with a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm.